You're watching ABC4 News. A family's worst nightmare, a fun boating trip ending in disaster, leaving them stranded on the water for days without food or water. The Coast Guard finally finding them miles from the shore. ABC's Laura Acevedo has the story. Well, the Coast Guard tonight is calling this rescue the best case scenario, saying the conditions on the water right now are very dangerous with rip currents and a boat over capacity, making it extremely unstable. This was the scene as the Coast Guard helicopter landed with seven people on board, all rescued after being stranded in the water for days. No food, no water. 18 people in total were on board. The Coast Guard says the small motorized boat was over capacity, 16 miles off the coast in international waters, drifting for the last five days after breaking down and slowly taking on water. Our cameras captured the moment the first seven people, including a two-year-old little girl and four-year-old boy, were walked off the helicopter, seen here getting food and medical attention from rescue crews. Three were transported to local hospitals. The Coast Guard says they got the call at four Wednesday afternoon after someone passing by spotted the boat. Fortunately, everyone on board was wearing life jackets and all are stable and expected to survive. And at last check with the Coast Guard, we do know that 11 men are still on board and they will be rescued by the Mexican Navy. Now, we did reach out to Customs and Border Protection, both at the local and national level, for comment on this rescue, but so far have not heard back. Reporting from Coast Guard Headquarters, Laura Acevedo, ABC 10 News.